Clutchbelt, a Warzone gamer, is receiving blowback from the community following an exchange with Sensei Swisham. When things became personal while the pro was competing in a competition, he started to mock the female streamer. Let's check it out. Hey guys, what's up and welcome back to Black Birdie Cod. For this video, we'll discover why Clutch Belk is getting cancelled. But before anything else, please leave a like on the video. Also, don't forget to subscribe to our channel and click the notification bell down below so you won't miss our future videos that we post either. Without any further ado though, let's go ahead and hop right on to the video. Chandler Clutch Belk Belk rose to prominence in the Warzone scene following the release of Modern Warfare. Belk signed with the CDL Pro Squad Los Angeles Gorillas as a content developer earlier in 2021, but things fell apart a week later. While Clutch Belk has earned over $66,000 through Warzone competitions, he has become embroiled in a controversy following an altercation with NYSL streamer Sensei Swisham. When the pro killed Sensei Swisham in a Warzone tournament, everything was good until a mod put a note in her Twitch channel. Sensei mocked it by posting a screenshot of the message in Belk's Discord. It appeared to be innocent amusement, but Clutch Belk asked, Why are you so pressed? This sparked a back and forth between the two, during which Belk accused her of crying about it. Others, such as Noobs and Queen Shadow, chimed in, wondering why Clutch Belk was so upset over nothing, but he insisted he wasn't. Everything appeared to be a minor altercation at first, but things grew up until Clutch Belk mentioned it in his broadcast. According to Sensei Swisham, it all started with the mods. In her tweet, she said how it all started. One of his mods came to my stream after Belt killed me and I thought it was funny so I put in the tourney discord for jokes, to which she attached the conversation that she had with Belk. On the tweet following that, she attached the clips where he mocked her and said, does she not know how effing dumb she sounds? What are you crying for? Are we in elementary school? It would go on for a little longer where Belk took some shots at Sensei Swisham. He was killed by another female player, Queen Shadow, and said, look at that, sitting on the roof like a good bee, in another clip. Sensei even accused Belk's mother of calling her a bee. She ended the series of tweets attaching how Belk was killed. She said, last clip, in this clip, Queen Shadows kills Belk. Before Belk sees who has killed him, he says, guess it's just nice shots. Then sees it was Ali who killed him, he says, yeah, sit up there like a good bee. Clutch Belk began his last stream by addressing the situation. He needed to get that settled and out of his chat. At the time of writing, his VODs were not available to the public, but someone shared a snippet from the beginning of his stream on Twitter with the caption, God forbid anyone tries to hold this giant man baby accountable for his actions. You already know at this point, all the industry's fans are coming to him. One tweet said, the funniest thing was at the beginning, he was asking everyone their opinions on how he had handled it, and when everyone went against him, he went to sub-only mode, and then deleted the comments that he didn't like. That's childish behavior. One fan even called out Twitch because of this. The Twitter user wrote, hey, at Twitch support, at Twitch, mind looking into the verbal abuse and harassment that this guy has been dealing to females in the gaming community and possibly elsewhere on your platform? Some people even compared the situation to Myers' usage of racist slurs by tweeting, I feel like this deserves the same attention as the Myers-Leonard situation. Dudes like this don't deserve a platform. We need to better ourselves as a people and a community. But it seems like not everyone is against him. Some of his proposed fans even defended him. One tweet said, I don't know if you've watched Belk streams before, but he's always calling people a good B. It's nothing to do with the fact that the person that killed him is a girl. Don't have anything against you, just FYI. To which a fan replied, sounds like a cop-out and an excuse to say what he said. Nevertheless, Sensei Swisham was still overwhelmed on the support that she received during the whole controversy. She took to Twitter to express her gratitude by saying, Thank you to everyone that is supporting me and backing me up on all this. I don't have a huge platform, but to see a community come together to weed out the bad in the scene is incredible. I hope this opens more eyes about the things that go down but are unspoken of. Thank you. But we want to hear your thoughts on this. What do you think of Clutch Belk's actions and how we got backlash for it? Let us know in the comment section down below. That's it for today. If you guys enjoyed the video, make sure you guys go ahead and hit that like button. Don't forget to subscribe and go ahead and turn on that notification bell so you never miss out on any future content we'll produce for you guys. We're signing off for now, but we'll be sure to catch you all in the next one.